What's up, YouTube? Big D and Chopper here. Now, you see, yo, I'm trying to practice. You see, I'm doing an audition video for, you know, the Animal Planet voiceover. So, I'm going to do the Animal Planet about insects. Like you see how the bumblebee and the wasp and more. So, I want to do the voiceover of that. Okay, here it goes. Let me know how I do. Okay, if you guys can see what's flying up there, you see those things are called the wasp. They're called the wasp. As you can see, they, they look like hornets, but hornets are actually bigger than wasp. But the wasp are, are this other type of insects that you see that be flying around your house. But the hard thing is you got to try to stay away from those, stay away from those things. They can... They can sting just like bees do. Well, female wasps, they sting, but males don't. What I just saw, the small one, the small one you just saw was a female. And the big one you just saw was a male. Because, you know, females sting, but males don't. The, you see, the males do the work while the females just fly around and in case something bothers them, they sting. And it really, really burns. And another thing about wasp, they'll they'll make their nest out of anything. They they'll make their nest from anything, including your house. They could do it in your they could do that in your barn, your attic, in your garage, anywhere. Anywhere they can find. They don't care. They don't care how fancy or how big the house is they can still make the homes including even in even in vehicles too they'll make a nest inside vehicles too like inside your gas tank of your vehicles but you know but there's one thing to get rid of those nests is to put is to use hot water because you know hot water makes the hot water kills the wasp and soap too Wasps don't like soap, cause when they, when the soap hits them, it make it'll make their wings get all wet, and they won't have room to fly. Now, if you look closely at the rosebush, you see the bumblebee is trying to get the nectar from the from the flower. You know, nectar is what honey it is what bees make honey for us to eat. But what they're mostly doing is pollinating the flowers. You see, when bees pollinate the flowers, it means they make the flowers bloom more prettier. I guess we all never thought about that about bees. So you see, bees are, aren't that scary, but they do know how to make the flowers bloom. That's their job, to make the flowers, to make the flowers bloom like in the daytime you see lots of bees do pollinate the flowers you see like this one you see how it's pollinating right there that's how bees that's what bees do make the flowers very pretty and mostly we be complaining about how bees sting but guess what yes they sting if you if you get too close to them I mean and they sting if you they bother if you bother them so the best thing is is to give us give him some space and let the bee do his job like chopper thank you now look at that you see how it's flying around the rose bus pollinate the flowers it's called pollination you see pollination is when bees work to make to pollen the flowers, make it a sparkle, and get some neck and get some nectar too. They they pollinate the flowers by hand. It's it's their job they do in spring. They pollinate the flowers by doing it by hands. Pollinate means fertilize.
and and fertilize means to make to make the plants grow prettier. That's what it's all about in springtime. Well, guys, let me know in the comment section if y'all like my audition video for if I want to do the Animal Planet narration with a show. So let me know in the comments below that if y'all like it or not. So, I'll see you guys next time in the spot. Peace. Oh, and don't forget, if y'all like it, y'all can, can go ahead and send it to the Animal Planet channel too.